Wow. Wow. Well, that was a pretty hard fall. Okay. So. I pledge allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of England. Now, you probably believe like this kid is on something. Why is he saying England? England because England is what we're going to be talking about today. But not just England. It's something about England. Something crazy about England that you guys will never know if I didn't say this. It's crazy. It's just crazy. It's crazy. Listen. All right. So basically, we have, uh, in America, we have swine flu. That's a new epidemic here. That's not good. We have, we have had the bird flu, which is not good. We have also had the canine flu. That's three things. That's three things. That's uno, dos, tres. That's three whole things. That's terrible. But England has something. England also has swine flu, I'm sure. But they have something else that we don't have here. That we, that we don't have here. It's crazy. Don't, don't, don't have here. It's crazy. Like, they have this allergy. Allergies. Allergies. Who cares if England has allergies? I have allergies, right? You have allergies, right? We all have allergies. That's right. You are right. Correct. Completely correct. Now, uh, let me just explain to you what kind of allergies that is, okay? Uh, we usually get allergies from a uh, sickness. But this guy from England, 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 he got a, he has this one type of allergy called spouse allergy I would call that and what type what kind of allergy is this spouse allergy now you're probably like what's a spouse if I didn't what's a spouse it's like a spouse is a husband a husband's wife is considered his, his spouse a, a wife's husband is considered her spouse yeah so a man from England claims to break out into a rash when he gets close to his wife Yeah, I'm, I'm waiting for the shock. It's it's that's that's what you guys should be like. He gets he gets he gets to his wife, man. To his wife. How come? Why his wife? That sucks. That sucks. He can't give her a hug when he gets back home from work every day. Every time they wake up in the morning, they look at each other in the eyes, and he can't give her a kiss and say good morning, sunshine. Hope you have a great day today. He can't do that. Why? Because he breaks out into a rash. He breaks out into a rash. That sucks. If the, if the wife needs a massage or if he needs a massage and they get close to each other, then hives, hives, hives pop out. Rash, redness, irritation, you know, all those things that women tend to give you. Just kidding. I love you guys. All right, so this guy, this guy's name is Darren Young. Now, I don't know how old he is, but he's allergic to a component regularly used in common creams and body lotions. Now, uh, this, uh, this uh, cream and body lotion kind of happened to, I guess, blend into the skin of this woman. But yeah, uh, his, uh, the Darren Young, his heart rate soars. It's, it, it may even stop when he, and his whole body swells up. It's... It's crazy if he comes into contact with the chemical known as polyethylene glycol, something like that. Young says he cannot get close to his wife. His wife's name is Sue, by the way, which is weird because Sue, he can... His wife, yeah. Sue, un Sue unless she is free of all creams. So if she doesn't have any of those creams on, then it's okay. It's all right. So it's not that bad. But the thing is that she needs these creams because she gets bubbles on her skin because when she was a little girl, then she used to take the, I think it's called the leffa, really, really hard and she used to just scrape because she thought that she had germs and cooties all over her. So, so she gets bubbles on her skin after she takes showers if she doesn't put these creams on. So she needs these creams on unless, or else she has these bubbles all over her skin and his, her husband doesn't want to look at this, like. Her husband doesn't want to look at bubbles on a person's face. I'm not saying that's something bad. It's for all you people that have that, I'm not saying that's something bad. But, uh, England. But, uh, I'm just saying that kind of sucks. He won't, he'll never get to see her again. And, uh, a quote that he said was, uh, It's not just Sue. 
I can get a reaction if I go into a pub or a restaurant where a woman has been sitting. The doctors don't really know why it has suddenly happened. Ladies and gentlemen, I would just like to concur that I did not have sexual relations with that woman. We all know where that comes from. That's, uh, doesn't matter where it comes from, but we all know where it comes from. And, uh, this guy has been cheating on his wife, probably. And he now has to be careful of what he touches and constantly carry medication. This could result in, like... And something terrible. His it can result in death. Actually, it's really really weird uh, to suddenly just come up with with a, some kind of allergy. That that sucks, right? It's it's crazy. It's like makes you freeze. Yeah, yeah. So. That's what I was going to talk about today. But there was something else I wanted to say. It was crazy. All right. So basically, I have a little sister. Yeah, I do. And this little sister happened to tell me a joke. <laughs> okay. So what did wall A behind me say to wall B on the other behind me? I'm sure you guys can recognize that right there, the printer. The pencil is in technical difficulties again. But it's okay. What did wall A say to wall B? Meet you at the corner. <laughs> all right, have a great day. You guys were all in Mike's office. Enjoy. Have a great night.